Hey, how's it going, everybody? This is Rafi Garcia coming at you with another video. And uh, this video, I'm going to name how to find great money making niche keywords using Micro Niche Finder. And uh, you can uh, go ahead and uh, I'll pause the video. And if you want to go right off the bat and head out to findmyniche.info, um, you can read all you want and uh, get access to some pretty cool videos on how to uh, use Micro Niche Finder for different. Uh, niches and uh, different uh, business ideas um, if not keep listening and I'm gonna show you right now just uh, how to target one niche and how to find it and how to how to make sure in minutes that it's a uh, it's a money-making niche and all of these other ones that you see over here are uh, future videos to come uh, all with micro niche finder uh, using micro niche finder it's uh, it's an awesome software an awesome tool that uh, I've uh, really just really enjoyed using it saves me a ton of time and um, it, you know it, it really can't uh, you can't go wrong with it especially for the price point that it's at I think it's like a hundred bucks you know and it's a one-time fee you get unlimited um, software updates you don't get no recurring fees or anything like that uh, support is awesome anytime there's a glitch or a problem you know um, uh, you, they're pretty accessible they respond back to you and as with anything they're constantly constantly updating their software so um, you're getting all those software updates you don't have to you know pay an, uh, an upgrade for anything like that so just I, I, I love micro niche finder um, but uh, going back to the main reason of this video is uh, how to find great money making uh, niche keywords alright so let's head on over to um, micro niche finder but before we go to that uh, this is uh, you you can go ahead and um, uh, look me up on Facebook and um, feel free to uh, add uh, add yourself to this uh, to this group. It's gonna give you all the um, highlights and the uh, some pretty cool access on how to really uh, position yourself and really know your niches. Okay, so going back over here, I went ahead and I took most of the uh, the hard, uh, uh, somewhat time-consuming steps uh, and I got you some. Uh, some data that we can work with and I did a I did a broad uh, keyword research for uh, teeth you know there's a lot of um, I wasn't sure what I what to expect I mean I had a couple things but uh, just for teeth and I just kind of narrowed it down and um, so here's what I, what you get right uh, teeth whining trays teeth whining pen um, I narrowed it down to whining you know how to get wider teeth and um, also what I did is I um, got to the uh, online commercial law on tension uh, an awesome awesome little uh, I don't even know what you can, what you can call it but it's like a little gold mine right there because it saves you a ton of time so what I base off my result is the local search count as long as it's above a thousand uh, it's all good it's golden uh, phrase count as long as it's above um, uh, or below 30,000, 25,000, uh, you're pretty much good to go. Ad costs, I just love seeing that because uh, it lets you know what uh, people and you know, what other um, marketers are paying on Google and other search engines to for this keyword right here. Let's say teeth whitening pen. Anybody, uh, when anybody logs on to uh, Google and uh, does a, a search for teeth whitening pen and they click on the left, click on the right side or the top side uh, uh, of uh, the AdWords and uh, Google Ads you know that person is paying like three dollars uh, and above for every click that they get and that's a lot of that's a lot of money just for that you gotta have a really good product that converts you know to advertise but hey people do it um, this one is as high as five dollars per click that's insane but um, then when you want to base it off is the online commercial intention. This is basically in what state uh, the person that's doing a search is uh, most likely to buy. It's either uh, people are in a, three different stages basically. They're, they're just gathering information. They're doing a basic research and they're just basically trying to gather some information. Or they're uh, somewhat they're, review, they're looking for reviews on a certain product. Or they're not sure if they're going to buy it or not. But they just want to know what's the best product out there. And there's people who just want to buy. You know, they're, you know, when they're searching for certain keywords, they're ready to buy. And as soon as you, they find something they like, they'll buy it like on the spot. So teeth whining trays, I can see why people are willing to pay. The market is willing to pay five bucks. You know, it's because they're in that state where um, they have ninety-four percent of the time uh, they'll 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 buy it. You know, whatever product you position in front of them, they'll buy it with that keyword. So that's pretty awesome to know that you know if you can target yourself. And then um, 
the SOC is uh, the strength of competition. So basically lets you know um, how heavily is uh, our other marketers uh, marketing and, and you know how, how, uh, how much competition you have. So anything within a yellow and it goes from red. So red you can see there's a lot of competition there. You don't even want to kind of try, especially if you're a beginner. So don't waste your time there. You're going to waste your time and energy. Uh, yellows, depending on uh, how how comfortable you are and how much knowledge you have over the uh, the keyword and the niche you're going to, you might be able to get yourself in there, but that's kind of on your own risk. Anything green like these, um, it's golden. You know, there's little competition. You can make, uh, you know, a good video review or a good article or whatever uh, means of marketing you want to do and get yourself pretty much on the top page of Google and, uh, you know, be out there getting free traffic without having to pay for it. You know, uh, articles, videos, um, blogs. Uh, if you want to do PPC, you can do that too. Um, so here, I mean, you you can base it off, and there's there's different variations to this, and I just like to look at it. Once I get all my information, once I get all these things, I just click on it, and I get I get the info. So right here, I got strength of competition. You click on it. Okay, there's reds. I want I want all the green ones. So all you can see, all of these right here, all these little awesome keywords: teeth whitening review, home teeth whitening. I mean, you can you imagine writing an article and just integrating these keywords in there? And uh, you know, look at that there's zero zero competition. I mean, it's yeah, green means go go for it. And I think about it, you position yourself on Google for teeth whitening review, or let's go how to how to whiten your teeth, how to whiten teeth at home. You know, you write an article about that, or do a video about it. You know, you uh, rating a product or something, and you name it that. And there's you know there's eight thousand people uh, looking for that information, right? And you know people are paying, uh, marketers are paying up a dollar plus on their competition. You know, thirty eight percent likely to buy. Or you can, you know, from here, then this is what I like to do. Once it's in green, too, is I try to go for the highest uh, online for where they're at in the state. So this one's a 62%. You know, teeth whitening review, 58%. Home teeth whitening, I could do a video about that. You know, people are paying five bucks for this. You know, it's 58%. So it's 50 50 chance they'll buy or not. But, you're, you know, what are you worried about? You know, you get free traffic. Uh, you know, let's say uh, you got 100 people that go that see your video only, uh, you know, five of them buy. Heck, that's. 100 people that's you know uh, that's uh, 500 bucks right there I think that you didn't have to spend to make whatever money you did make you know so it's pretty easy it's basic it's uh, once you get the hang of it you can make money on the spot you just got to do the work you got to do the research beforehand you know it's like when you start a business you have a, you have to have a business plan first in order to just uh, in order to open your store and get the infrastructure going on stuff same thing here in order to start marketing anything and you want to go make sure you have the research and make sure that the numbers make sense make sure that there's enough people searching for um, uh, the for the I have a problem you know and want a solution and that the it makes sense so uh, yeah to sum it up uh, we're running uh, close to eight minutes uh, so I went off on a little uh, uh, had my little moment so yeah if you want to learn how to you know uh, where you can start using micro niche finder feel free to go to findmyniche.info and uh, you can get uh, the free videos that uh, show you uh, some pretty cool ways to make money using it and um, you can also um, get back to me on Facebook and let me know what you uh, think of the um, the ways that I'm using it, and uh, you know if you see yourself that that it could help you out. All right, this is Rafi Garcia signing off. Um, we'll be making future videos, and if you have any future comments or feedbacks or uh, future ideas for future videos to make, uh, please feel free to let me know either by comment or uh, Facebook message. All right, have an awesome awesome weekend and uh, awesome week. All right.